Hello everyone, uh, Frank here. If you're running one of these late model Ural sidecar outfits that are fitted with the uh, Brembo brakes, um, today I'd like to show you how to set up the uh, brake bias between the sidecar and the motorcycle brakes. Step one is to locate the uh, sidecar brake bias adjuster. So if we walk around the bike and locate the back brake, it's a good start. So here we have back brake pedal. There you go. As you can see, the back brake uh, for the rear wheel on the motorcycle, this is the this is the adjuster here. And we have a shaft that runs all the way through. You can see it's just through the gap there. You can see it run all the way through to the sidecar. So looking over the bike down the center and hey presto. So we have the uh, fluid reservoir and the said linkage which comes from the back brake for the motorcycle all the way through and a cylinder in here which operates the back brake on the sidecar. Step two, so once you've located this uh, cover you take a 10 mil socket and uh, undo these bolts like so and remove the cover like so. So just pull these bolts out quickly And hey presto, once you've removed the cover, here we can see the Brembo master cylinder and the fluid reservoir. Basically this is for the uh, single side uh, sidecar wheel uh, Brembo brake. Step three, so once you've exposed this linkage, uh, the next step is to um, undo the little lock nut there on the on the adjuster like so So we've gone down there 10 mil open-ended and just break like so This means you can wind this out of the way In the book it calls for a, a good starting point anyway is to um, Make sure there's a one millimeter gap or thereabouts between the end of this uh, plunger shaft here, which goes into the into the piston, which operates the piston for the master cylinder. Make sure there's like a one mil gap between the end of this shaft and uh, its seat in 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 the, in the piston. You do this by winding this in like so, and until it touches. And you can feel that very gentle and then what I do is just take it back so uh, one so one two three flats on this adjuster step four so once you've done this um, get one of your intrepid friends if you can to sit in the sidecar and go out for a test ride um, what you're looking for with like a 80 or 90 kilo person in there is a pretty neutral feel when you when you break. If you screw this in too far, it will mean your sidecar brake will operate before your motorcycle brake, and you will pull violently to the left, which is obviously not what we want and all, on the other hand if you don't have enough um, if it's adjusted too wide which is anti-clockwise if you don't have enough braking especially with someone in the car uh, when you brake uh, because the sidecar uh, is not braking enough 
it'll have a tendency to want to pull to the right so it's a bit of um, it's a bit of adjust and and fine balancing on the road to get this right in summary to this quick video basically screwing this clockwise um, will increase your brake bias for the sidecar and anti-clockwise will decrease um, like I say it's a matter of uh, suck it and see and, and just you'll get a feel for it um, preferably with someone sat in the car and if you get a nice neutral braking with someone sat in the car I don't think you can do much more more than that okay final step is to uh, tighten that back up the little lock nut and then replace your cover with the 10 mil bolts and you're good to go Et voila job done so if you found this video um, helpful and you'd like to receive more content in the future please hit the subscribe button cheers